Meanwhile, a protest outside a Detroit public schools bus terminal caused a partial road closure this morning on Greenfield Road near Belton on the city's west side. And as Jen Shans reports, the group was protesting the district's start of summer school, which includes in-person learning, because they say it's putting students and staff at risk. Dozens of protesters gathered outside the West Side bus terminal this morning, starting at 5 o'clock. They're outraged that Detroit Public Schools is resuming in person instruction for students today. First, the protesters blocked the bus terminal with their bodies, then, they blocked it with a large tree branch, aiming to stop bus drivers from making their routes. Detroit children cannot be used as guinea pigs. No amount of masks, hand sanitizer, or social distancing will be enough to take the risk. That's the message from these protesters, blocking Detroit schools' west side bus terminal by all means. Detroit and other black communities around the country have been hit hard enough by this pandemic. We are not going to let it surge again here if there's anything we can do about it. And that's why we're out here today to shut the buses down. This comes as Detroit school summer courses start today. Superintendent Dr. Nikolai Vidi has said there was a clear need for in-person learning, as online instruction can put a burden on working families. And some children in the district don't have the resources to rely solely on virtual learning to catch up. He says more than 300 teachers applied to fill the 170 face-to-face -face positions available this summer. We're asking staff to come in. They haven't tested our students, and as I told you, some staff have not been tested. In addition to smaller classes, there will also be regular temperature checks for students and staff, Dr. Vitti said. <laughs> Several people tried to enter the terminal, which remained blocked off for most of the morning. People like this bus driver named Rich. I'm just trying to get to work. I'm off of these kids, but also I have bills. This driver turned in his badge. He says driving students to school in the midst of a pandemic didn't feel right. It's not right in the sight of God, and I cannot do it. Just this morning? Just this morning, yes. In a statement on offering summer courses, Dr. Vitti says in part, quote, it was important that we meet parents and students where they are at, meaning for some parents and students that is online and the other that is face to face. Of the 4,000 parents who signed up for summer school, half signed up for face to face instruction. There should have been a foot put down and said, no, I'm not going to put these children's lives right. in danger. Right. Police have been on scene all morning. We haven't seen any arrests, but we also haven't seen any buses actually leave the terminal. We've reached out to the district to see how this morning's protests affected student turnout today. In Detroit, Jen Shantz, 7 Action News. Jen, thank you.